Okay, Deontay, hip, full practice. Mm -hmm. Cam Sutton, hamstring, DNP. Mm -mm -mm. Weatherspoon, hamstring, DNP. Yep, nope, I'm good. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. What do you mean? Ah, man. All right, I'm I'm talking myself into this plus eight. Let's hear it. Come on. I already Come on. have the Steelers plus eight. So I know either, you it's do. It's either you take the Bucks. No, no, I mean? I'm thinking dual. I'm thinking in this vein and also. Are you thinking your score prediction? I'm thinking both veins. That's what I'm saying. Like we, we still got to do our score prediction. Yeah, too. yeah. You see what I'm saying? So are you off on? What are you doing with the the plus eight minus eight? You want to keep? <laughs> let's just go through this injury because report. this is this is my issue. You ready for this? I'm talking myself into this thing, and I'm looking for everything I can to make it make sense to me. When you're telling me plus eight, at first I'm kind of like, you know what? I don't want to pick against you right here. I want to be able to say, you know what, man? Yeah, let's watch this game because I'm rolling with the Steelers as well because the plus eight. But when I hear Cam Sutton and Akello aren't out there and I'm thinking to myself, how are the Bucks fitting to attack our defense? That's where they was going. Why they were healthy. So now I'm thinking to myself, like, they going, man. Her. It's making me mad, you know? Levi Wallace. Concussion. Good news. LP. There we go. All right, all right, all right. That's a step in the right direction. That's a step. There we go. Terrell Edmonds, concussion, FP. That's back to all back. Right, all right, Definitely going to need him. Definitely need my man's yeah. out there. Edmonds they give us more versatility as well, too, man. Let's not forget about Casey. Uh-huh, that's what I'm saying. This will give us versatility, bro. Menka, knee, DNP. Just rest. We resting him. We he ain't needs tripping. it. He needs, he's on Travis Adams. Just had him on. FP. And you heard what he said, too. He said, bro, I just got them needles done. Just got them needles in my junk. I'm he's good. Right. And now let's go out there and have a little fun with it, man. Mason Cole Foot DNP. I think he's playing, right? Yeah. We pray to God he's playing. Yeah, the ones I'm more worried about are the well, corners. Well, Hassan would come in, right? Yeah, but to me, it's the corners that stand out to me the most. Um, um, also, Pat and Larry. What about them? Yeah, Pat, LP, okay. Larry, DNP. Zach, FP. So Zach will play. Okay. Gentry. Yeah. They like said... Pat's interesting just because the whole concussion thing and the three within a year and a half right now, and that's just... Well, and just even how it happened. Yeah. Even though he looks yeah. right right now. He ain't look he right when it happened, bro. Yeah, so. he did not look right when it happened. Yeah. Bucks injury report? Yeah, we got on there, man. Great. Concussion, FP. Jalen Darden with the tooth. Now mm -hmm. he's back, FP. Did he get his tooth fixed? I guess so. That's why I need to know. Is the tooth still in there or not? Because Cole Beasley, I mean, we lost his tooth. He was actually in the game with that thing just hanging out. <laughs> Carlton Davis, hip, FP. Okay, okay. Mike Edwards, elbow, LP. Russell Gage, LP. So most of these guys are getting upgraded here. Yeah, because like you said, Carlton was the one yesterday. Wasn't he limited yesterday? Or was he full yesterday too? Full. Uh, Gage was the DNP. That's what it was, okay. Yeah, Mike Edwards was LP yesterday as well. <sighs> Golston, rest, DNP. Okay. Chris Godwin, they have DNP, but they have also listed rest along with yeah. his hip and knee. What Team about Hex? I was gonna say yeah, foot, yeah, DNP. Okay, Julio, DNP. That's okay, good. keep Julio up out there. Yeah, Sean Murphy, Bunting, DNP. Okay, quad, Nasib, illness, full practice. That's what yesterday so he had the back. illness. Yeah, he was DNP yesterday. I mean, he's had a little bubble gut to happen. Perryman, knee, hamstring, full practice. Okay. Yeah, they're gonna be both right. All right. All right. Logan Ryan, DNP, and Donovan Smith, tackle, LP. Mm. So I stand by my uh, plus eight, though. Yeah, I'm going to just leave the plus eight alone. I don't want to mess with the plus eight. I ain't feeling the plus eight thing. You don't want to make the pick? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm cool, right, I'm cool on so that. You're going Steelers plus eight? I'm just yep, no, I'm just going to leave it alone. Can we just not even just, I'm just leave that one alone, man? We do need to do our score predictions, though, right? Actually, you know, we could just read some supers and get up out of here, man. We ain't got to do all that, bro. It's up to you, man. We ain't got to do that, though. We ain't got to. Let me at least make my prediction. Th there we go. You should make your prediction, and then we should read Super Chats, and then we should be good. That's what we should do today, man. That's what we should do. Let's go, UW. Yeah, yeah. When <laughs> is the reverse Kirk Cousins? Yes. There we go. <laughs> yes. I see where he's going with Cause, that. Because Kirk is a 1 o'clock guy or a 9 a.m. guy if he's, uh, you know, across the pond. You know, right. he gets it in. You don't want him in prime time when them lights come on. In fact, yeah, my only time playing Kirk was in prime time. Maybe that's why I like playing in prime time, bro. Monday night football. I think your only loss picking Kirk this year was whenever it was, he was Eagles, in prime Vikings time. in prime time. Yeah. And I won Eagles. Yeah. That's it. Derek Dunn. Thoughts on playing Mark Robinson, an inside linebacker? Love the show. Love the show, too. Steelers, by the way. 
y'all play RuneScape? Question mark. Hashtag Go Steelers. No, I've never played RuneScape. That's that's still around. Bro, I had no clue what RuneScape was. No, what is it? It's like uh, almost like a Dungeons and Dragons type oh, of thing. Oh, okay, online, okay. Where uh, you like create a character and you're just going around and doing stuff. Yeah, it's like, like a virtual world. Okay. Yeah, actually, no, I have not, man. Were you ever into like Dungeons and Dragons? No. Yeah, I never got into like I still like I like to watch movies along that type of stuff. I just like the Harry Potters and stuff, Lord of the Rings stuff like that. But yeah, I never really got into like the game element of that though. I had a couple friends that used yeah. to play back in the day. I mean, this is going back to like grade school. Yeah, I didn't know it was still around. It was popular yeah. back then. It was almost like a Fortnite back then. Mm -hmm. I think, but okay. I never, I never got into it. I was always a Madden guy. Madden and NCAA football. Same. Some NHL. Yeah. And then I got older and it was Call of Duty. I want to shoot you. All right. But um, thoughts on Mark Robinson, that inside linebacker? No, I like Mark a lot, man. Um, He obviously is a really good young player right now. I personally, my biggest dilemma is if I'm putting him on the field and I'm taking off Spillane, Bush, or Miles Jack, I do feel like right now those three guys have been playing at a high level, Um, not just in terms of the productivity in stadium but the above the net game as well so just the alignment some of the pre-snap communication my concern is you implement mark robinson in here with all the other changes and all the other younger inexperienced players that are playing out there and it's just another issue that potentially you have to deal with in terms of now he's getting acclimated now he's learning to communicate with these guys you're worrying about him as a younger player in his own regard making rookie mistakes as well with the defense that is already dealing with a ton of moving pieces because of the injury. So that's the other reason why for me personally right now, even though I would like to see Mark at some point in time, I just don't think the time makes sense to put him out there in what they're dealing with right now defensively with some of the injuries and stuff. Is Casey practicing this week? I feel like this would be bigger news. It's really flying under the radar. They say yeah. his suspension is lift, lifted. He's, I is thought he was going to be out there this the week. the NFL's right. official transaction sheet for suspension. And with some of the injuries that we've had, Has anyone it asked would make Tom sense. About it? Yeah. I feel like it would be bigger news. Yeah, I haven't this checked. Kind what of did a big you, deal. Did you, you type his name in it, right? Yeah, it's saying he's off the suspension list. Yeah. Are we going to do some BS where we don't play him? Like we need Bro, him out there. Oh, start that. We definitely need him out there. We need him out there. Yeah, I would agree. 